District police and medical authorities still can't say whether Arlen Williams was the hero of the Air Florida crash. What they can say is that Williams was the only victim of the crash that showed no major injury but drowning. Williams' name was on the list of dead presented at today's news conference, a question mark by the word drowning. We need to know further information such as was he uh, seat belted into his seat at the time, which would of course uh, be important to know. It's hard to say really how many of these people uh, were, uh, were conscious, I mean how many of the remaining few that had uh, somewhat less extensive, not um, immediately fatal uh, trauma, how many of them could have been uh, conscious or unconscious. Or all victims of the Air Florida crash have now been identified and all have undergone an autopsy. According to Washington's medical examiner, for 73 of the victims, the crash was not survivable. Dr. Douglas Hickson indicated 57 of the jet's passengers died within a matter of seconds, most of fatal head injuries. District of Columbia police also indicated that from a preliminary study of 22 of the dead, 10 passengers were still strapped in their seats. There are still many unanswered questions about the Air Florida crash. The search for what happened continues. In Washington, Andrea Fleischer, Action News.